Hello everyone, welcome back. For today's video we decided to play a little bit different, we're going to Severny. Um, yep. No comments. When this happens to you, try to move the camera in your direction to try to balance the spinning. I'm not really sure why this happens, but it sure happens sometimes. The best thing to do is not to panic, just try to move the joystick gently and you should be fine. Thanks to this bug, we're going to be a little bit far from our city, but it's fine. The reason why we're going to Severny is to try a different strategy. Since the blue zone is not going to do a lot of damage, a lot of players like to go to a place where there's no one near to them. I've noticed a lot of players trying this strategy, but you need to be really careful because you never know if there's going to be someone copying the same idea. Most of the times are considered safe places. The loot is not going to be amazing, in my opinion, unless it's novel, but you're going to have enough loot for two people or four people in order to make it to the mid game. Don't forget this is diamond gameplay, there's still going to be bots. And this is pretty random, sometimes you're going to find a lot of bots and in some games you're not going to find any of them. Remember that for this series our goal is to get as many points as possible and that's because we want to show you how to get conquer with this series. Phoenix. What are you doing? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Phoenix, calm down, girl, calm down. So it's one of those days where Phoenix is acting a little bit weird. I don't remember what I did, but let it go, I guess. You already know about all of this. Behind the mask, below the helmet. You never know who's hiding there. Anyways, she seems she's happy again, so let's keep up with our venture. After a while, try to be really careful because there might be people coming to these places, so never let your car down. We need to deal with these players. Easy kill, hold side for the win. We shouldn't be worried about these guys because normally they are bots. I know this is your kill Phoenix but I'm really bored and I wanna practice with a single mode scar. Overall Severny it gave us what we needed. We have enough loot for mid game and we have at least 4 kills. When you reach this step while grinding you now need to focus to get top 10 or top 3. And that is exactly our next goal what we're going to try to do. If we get killed right now we're not going to get enough points maybe like 2 or 3. So we really need to look for a top 5 or top 3. We're going to start playing a little bit more aggressive but at the same time we're going to be really careful. If you're playing duo never take a bike and never take a buggy. Always go for the Dacia and always go for the jeep that has a roof. So you know who's going to be driving right now, best driver in PUBG Mobile by far. We're gonna try to get more kills and that's the reason why we decided to go to Pochinki. And here's my tip, never let your guard down in Pochinki. Always assume there's someone hiding in Pochinki and if it's the mid game like right now, you need to be really careful because if that guy survives, it means he's probably a really good player. Sadly for us, it seems there's not a lot of people right here. Finally we can hear some shots. And this is why Phoenix is not allowed to go to Pochinki. I'm gonna try to surprise this guy, she's telling me he's in a blue tower. Come on boy, I know you wanna peek. And one, and two. <coughs> GG's Gorkem. I'm not a really fan of the SKS, but I know some people want me to show one. They want me to showcase it. So we're going to take advantage of this video and see what we can do with this amazing weapon. It's not a bad weapon of course, I'm not used to use it to be honest. Sometimes I'm really good with it and sometimes I'm really bad with it. But if you truly want to be a weapon master, you need to master every weapon and know how to use it. Let me explain really quick that at this point we're trying the 4 year achievement. We need to collect 20 credits from dead enemies. 
and that's the reason why I'm risking going to the blue zone even though I don't need more loot. I lost count of how many crates I opened, I don't understand this achievement pretty well. But don't worry guys, I know there are new achievements and once I reach Platinum in solo classic mode, you know I'm gonna try them. Here's another tip guys, if you're going to hide behind a drop, make sure you're well hidden. Really nice job from the SKS, now I need to find his friend. There he is. And this is one of those days where I can say I really like the SKS. As I mentioned before, I'm just going to go for it. I don't know how the achievement really works. I don't know if I just need to open the crate or if I need to take something from the crate. This is something I am only doing because of the achievement. This is kind of risky and unnecessary to be honest. So please take that into account because I don't recommend you grind achievements and try conquer at the same time. The only reason I'm doing this of course is because I want to have a video for you guys. Two guys left, eight kills, so far so good. There goes Phoenix and I need to rush this guy. There he goes, now Phoenix is smart, she's going to get behind the reach. I don't think this guy is that close so he won't be able to rush us. He's the final guy, I need Phoenix to have full health, that's why I'm dropping my full medkit. And she's not going to take it because she's an ungrateful teammate. I have no idea where this guy is so we need to be moving all the time. Phoenix dinner, GG boys. I know this wasn't a hectic match like other ones, but I really wanted to land in another place, test it, tell you my opinion about it, and I also wanted to show you the SKS, how good of a weapon it can be, especially if you're trying to grind in diamond gameplays. And guys, next episode is going to be the last one in diamond gameplay. After that, I'm gonna show you how people are playing in Crown, so stay tuned for that guys, and as always, if you really like this series, don't forget to give it a like, the support of this series is usually really incredible. Also, don't forget to share, comment, like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more content. Tomorrow, I'm going to take my computer to repair, you know the story. There's probably not going to be live streams this weekend, I'm sorry about that. It isn't something I want to do, but I really need to repair my computer as soon as possible. So thank you so much for understanding. Thank you so much for watching, and I will snipe you soon. Peace.